to be present here for the award ceremony organized by Chemexil for its outstanding exporters for two years. 2017, 18, and 2018, 19. And I see a huge list. There are 72 from the year 2017, 2018, and 62 from the year 2018, 19. So I'm sure you're doing a lot of good work, which is why we have so many of you in so many different categories. And the best is that as Mr. Chair, Chairman informed that most of the award winners today are the MSMEs, which is a wonderful thing. Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi ji, he puts a lot of trust on motivating and promoting our MSMEs even when it comes to exports. So I'm glad a lot of our awardees today are the MSMEs. Uh, to replace the Chinese supply to the other other part of the developed countries. So after this COVID and we have uh, our industry uh, members have been developed many of the technologies and products and in their in-house uh, uh, making their uh, R&D very uh, uh, updated and that now the years to come maybe here, this uh, next five years you will see many specialty chemicals which is replacing Chinese market uh, to the world and India is uh, you know it is now sector oriented we are uh, district level the government is facilitating us for giving the all the uh, infrastructure developments as well as the technology development centers by the UDCT, IICT so that will definitely help and uh, we will definitely compete and reduce the imports which is uh, today our Prime goal is to reduce the imports. Uh, Ma'am, on the FT. Just announced yesterday $770 billion. And uh, this sector, chemical industry, which you know is uh, India's fastest growing. And we have six largest producers of chemicals. So this has a contribution of $30 billion, which has been made to exports this year. And how is compared to the previous year? And what is the growth you are expecting? And the uh, current uh, financial. Well, income? the. Uh, the growth has been quite steady because 2020-21 uh, it was 23 billion dollar. Then the next year uh, they registered a growth of uh, say about uh, 27 billion dollar. And this year, although the target was 32, but uh, they have been uh, uh, they have succeeded in achieving 30 billion dollar, which is pretty good. And the rate at which the sector is growing, um, I am sure that in times to come. The chemical industry sector is going to make a huge contribution to the bigger target of $2 trillion of overall exports, which uh, India has set for the year 2030. And you, you missed $2 billion. I know the target was uh, $32. You achieved 30 So what was the, uh, what, why it happened and what is the target for this year? Now for this year, the target I don't think has been set. They will now decide. It is set. April yeah, because, uh, See, in terms of overall export targets, if I talk, last year, uh, we achieved $676 billion, merchandise and services put together. So this year, I mean, there has been a good progress. We are standing here today at $770 billion, and 30 is the contribution that this sector has made. I'm sure next year it will be even more. Exactly. Ma'am, what we are doing for the China Plus, because everybody outside the world, are looking for the China plus one strategy, what we're doing in the chemical uh, sector. Uh, uh, I, I guess the chairman would be the better person to answer this. What we're doing for the China plus one. 